very good morning to all you lovely people present here. DSK School is a hub of diverse activities, right from formal subjects to art, dance, sports, and various co-curricular activities. And on behalf of the entire team of DSK School, I, Natasha Sheikh, heartily welcome you all to the 20th Annual Day program. The brilliant faces exhibiting their talents in front of you today will grow up to achieve great success, name and fame. We are all gathered here on this annual day to motivate and inspire these young minds to showcase their performances on stage. To make this event a blessed one, we will start with the lamp lighting ceremony with Shiva Stuti. So now, so now I request Poonima ma'am and all the dignitaries to please come forward to light the lamp. Thank you so much, ma'am. I request the dignitaries to please take their seat. Today is a special occasion, and it is going to be a memorable one for sure. It is indeed an honor to be surrounded by so many special people, and it gives me immense pleasure to welcome our esteemed and distinguished guests today. The fragrance of flowers spreads only in the direction of the wind, but the goodness of a person spreads in all directions. We have amongst us a very inspiring personality. Our chief guest for today, Mrs. Shubhada Pendarkar, school psychologist and preschool educator. Ma'am, I extend a warm welcome to you and I thank you for taking our time to grace this occasion. A visionary is someone who can see the big picture and has the ability to inspire and guide others towards a shared vision. We are privileged to have the gracious presence of the president of DSK Educational Society, Mrs. Hemanti Kulkarni. Ma'am, thank you for coming here to encourage our little champs. The task of the leader is to get the people from where they are to where they have not been. I would now like to welcome the vice president of DSK Educational Society, Ms. Rama Kale. Ma'am, your vision and goal for our school motivates us to reach greater heights. Thank you for gracing our event with your presence. Mentorship is the capacity to translate vision into reality. We are honored to have amongst us the academic advisor of DSK School, Mrs. Bharati Barate. Ma'am, we thank you for taking time out to be a part of our celebration. The courage to make tough decisions and the compassion to listen to the needs of others is an art. This quote is very fitting to our principal, Ms. Jayashree Mule. Ma'am, your endless care, guidance, and support prove that you are a great leader. We are really blessed to have a principal like you. With a grateful heart, we welcome you, dear ma'am. I would now like to welcome the captain of our ship, the backbone of pre-primary section, our coordinator, Mrs. Jyoti Dixit. Ma'am, your sense of commitment creates an apt platform for us to grow both personally and professionally. On this great morning, we welcome you, dear Jyoti, ma'am. To the world, you may be just one person, but to your child, you are the world. With immense pleasure, I welcome our dear grandparents and parents. We cherish your partnership and collaboration in all our endeavors. We este your esteemed presence amongst us today makes us feel proud. Everyone who remembers his own education remembers teachers, not methods and techniques. The teacher is the heart of the education system. I take this opportunity to welcome our dear teachers who chisel and shape our students' lives. And finally, yet most important of all, a very warm welcome to our lovely students without whom this event wouldn't have been possible. 
The time has come when I would like to request our respected principal, Ms. Jayashri Mule, to express her feelings about today's event and uplift our spirits. A big round of applause for her, please. Honorable President, Mrs. Hemanti Kulkarni, respected guest of honor, Mrs. Shubhada Pendarkar, Vice President, Mrs. Rama Kale, educational advisor, Mrs. Bharti Barate, esteemed faculty members, proud parents, and our most promising students. A warm welcome to each and every one of you to our annual pre-primary day celebration. It's a joyous occasion where we come together to celebrate the wonderful journey of our young ones, learn learners, as they take their initial steps into the world of education. First and foremost, I would like to extend my heartfelt gratitude to all the parents who have entrusted us with care and education for their precious ones. Your unwavering support and trust means the world to us. And we are committed to nurturing and guiding your children with utmost care and dedication. Today, as we gather to celebrate the achievement of our little stars, let us also reflect on the significance of early childhood education. The pre-primary years are the foundational in shaping child's future and it's during this time they develop the essential skills like values, attitudes that will stay with them for life. Th through play, exploration, hand-on experiences, our students are not only acquiring the academic knowledge but also developing importance of social, emotional, cognitive skills. They are the learnings to collaborate, communicate, problem solving, and thinking creatively. Skills that are essential for the success of 21st century. So let us celebrate the achievement of our little ones today, but let us also reaffirm our commitment to providing them with the best possible start in life. Together, let us continue to inspire, motivate, empower young learners to dream big, aim high, and make positive difference in the world. I also like to express my heartfelt thanks to Mrs. Shubhada Pendarkar. Madam, your presence has elevated our show. I express my gratitude to our management for their unwavering support and guidance. Thank you once again to every one of you, your unwavering support, and let the celebration begin. Thank you. Thank you so much, Jayashree, ma'am. Like a beacon in the darkness, your speech illuminated our minds. So now, today we have with us a very special guest, a strong supporter and promoter of child-centric education with a teaching experience of over four decades. She's also an avid trekker and has won a gold medal in basketball at national level. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Shubhada Pendarkar. It's time to express our gratitude to our esteemed guest. So without further delay, I would request the Honorable President of our DSK Education Society, Mrs. Hemanti Kulkarni, to felicitate our chief guest with a bouquet and a citation as a token of our appreciation. Our recipient of Best Teachers Award from Zilla Parishwar in 2001, Mrs. Shubhada Pendarkar holds a master's degree in psychology from SNDT College and a postgraduate diploma in school psychology from Yana Prabodhini Institute of Psychology, Pune University, where she secured a silver medal for the same. She also holds a postgraduate diploma in nursery school education from Nirmala Niketan, University of Mumbai. She has been a member of the advisory committee and a senior facilitator for the Teachers Empowerment Program with Shrujan Pratishtan Shamata Vikasan Kendra for the past nine years. She was the headmistress of Pune Polis Public School under the management of Symbiosis for seven years and has an experience of 25 years in Muktangan English School. She has co-authored 20 books for pre-primary level the books deal with cognition, phonetics, reading, writing, mathematical skills, environmental sciences, and project method. She's currently 
working as a head program and training with Smart Phonics, Avid Readers, and as a headmistress of Smart Champs International Preschool since 2016. A big round of applause for Shubhada Ma'am, please. Now I request our esteemed chief guest, Mrs. Shubhada Pendarkar, to speak a few words about her on diverse and life experiences in the education field. Please put your hands together for ma'am. A very good morning and a happy morning to one and all. Honorable President, Mrs. Himanti Kulkarni, respected uh, Vice President, Mrs. Ramakaye, educational advisor, Mrs. Bharati Bharate, esteemed faculty members and proud parents, grandparents and my dear students. First and foremost, I sincerely thank you all for inviting me as a guest of honor for Sapno Ki Udan, the pre-primary social gathering. It is my pleasure to be present here on this joyous occasion. I, being a psychologist, I would just like to brief you with few things which are important in parents, grandparents, teachers, students, and children's life. Everybody knows that there are four types of intelligences, right? But those intelligences are not to be kept only on paper. They are to be actually applied. The new NAP always says that it is application which is more important. So I'll just talk a little about it. Everybody knows the first is the IQ, that is the intelligence quotient. Now what is IQ? This is the measure of your level of comprehension. You need to solve IQ to solve mathematics and all other things to recall lessons. It is not what marks your child gets parents and grandparents but if you give your child even a senior kg child now a hundred rupee note and ask him to go to a grocery shop and ask him to buy brown bread okay brown bread costs somewhere about 50 rupees now so if he gets that change of 50 rupees back that is iq okay Marks are just on paper, right? Hmm? Exam tests your memory power, but the practical application is needed more. Now let's talk about the EQ, and that is the emotional quotient. This is the measure of your ability to maintain peace with others, keep to time, be responsible, be honest, respect boundaries, and be humble, genuine, and considerate. Manage, try and manage your own tempers, and your children's tempers also. Many a times now these days, uh, we see parents while the child is uh, having food, the mobile is on, right? Why? Talk to the child about what he did in school. That is not I, what I want. What all happened in school? Everybody is just bothered about the abhyas. Abhyas is going to be lifelong. If you talk to them in such a friendly manner, that is your EQ and teach them to manage it. Now, if you give them the mobile, okay, and you are also on the mobile, what is going to happen? The child is going to see that I Baba, grandparents are on mobile. Why I should not be on mobile? I'll also be on mobile. So, Try and restrict yourself from the mobiles. They are papers, they are books. That is your emotional quotient where you have to see it. Then is the social quotient which is very, very important. This is the ability to build a network of friends and maintain it over a long period of time. Let's take a small example. Uh, your academic uh, consultant, Bharati Bharate. Actually, her... First, elder sister is my friend but both of us have maintained such a good relationship we do not meet every day but we know both of us are there for each other that is your social quotient it is not how many likes I like on the Facebook and on the Insta and on the Twitter and all that 
but it is who will really come and help you during your crisis everybody comes and helps you in your happy occasions but in your crisis that is your social quotient then comes the adverse adversity quotient which is very very important and this is the measure of your ability to go through a rough patch in life and come out of it without losing your mind cut cut karana cut cut that is not there especially during the pandemic what happened everybody knows okay or if a loved one is undergoing a serious uh, medical um, say history or something how are you going to tackle it that is your social quotient remember kids are very observant they follow your footsteps right again being a psychologist i go more on research so what does the research show the research shows people having higher eq and sq tend to go further in life than those who have higher iq but low eq and sq now if any one of you are in the it you all will know that when it is interviewed your eq and your sq is measured more not your iq okay teachers and parents should improve all these four quotients of the child that is very very important again every all of us want to be very good parents <clears throat> right but is there something can you be very good parents by just reading books no you have to actually apply it books are there sagla ahe but application is different okay i'll just tell you a small story right once there was a school retired principal and a smart young banker okay both of them were very good friends the banker always wanted to give more than what everybody needed one evening both of them went out and when they went out they said let's go and buy some nice plants let's uh, do some gardening so both of them got the same type of plants and they had bungalows so they um, planted those nice plants in their bungalows the retired principal watered the plants and took care of them in moderation he gave them the right amount what the plants needed while the banker cared for the plants more than needed the principal's plants were very healthy the but the banker's plants looked healthier what happened one night it rained very very heavily so in the morning the two friends went out to see what has happened to their plants the banker was surprised to see that all his plants were ruined but the principal's plants were not at all affected the banker started worrying are i watered the plants so well i gave them a lot of khat pani i gave them a lot of nutrition what happened so he went to the retired principal and he asked him how your plants survived you watered them less than i watered you gave them less nutrition to this the principal said you must not water the plants to quench their thirst rather water it only to give them strength so that the roots go deep into the soil once the root go deep into the soil they will be firm so when you give more water to the plants than needed it does not have its own growth i think similar is with parenting we were just talking just now and everybody we were saying that more is given to the child why because we know more because of all the network systems that are there but i would say sometimes give a little less to your child than he needs it is also beneficial and for that the child has the hunger and the potential to grow and fight back okay only give your finger to support your child 
डोंट गिव देम युअर हँड फुल हँड चल माझं बोट पकड दॅट इज वॉट यू हॅव टू टीच देम हात पकड नाही म्हणायचं बोट पकड सो दॅट ही नोज दॅट द पेरेंट्स अँड द ग्रँड पेरेंट्स आर देअर विथ मी वेन एव्हर आय वॉन्ट दॅम ओके फाईन डी एस के स्कूल हॅज ग्रेट टीचर्स हू इन्स्पायर युअर किड्स अँड युअर पेरेंट्स यू ऑल आर व्हेरी लकी पेरेंट्स टू गेट ॲडमिटेड इन सच अ रेप्युटेड स्कूल द मॅनेजमेंट द प्रिन्सिपल्स द टीचर्स ऑफ डी एस के आर ट्राईंग द बेस्ट लाईक द सेम गोज अ गुड टीचर इज लाईक अ कॅन्डल इट कन्झ्युम्स इट्स लाईट टू गिव वे टू द अदर्स द मिडिओक टीचर टेल्स द गुड टीचर एक्सप्लेन्स द सुपिरियर टीचर डेमॉन्स्ट्रेट्स बट द ग्रेट टीचर इन्स्पायर्स ओके थँक यू ओके जस्ट इन अ मिनिट आय फिनिश इट विद्या आपल्यापासून कोणी चोरी करू शकत नाही बाकी दागिने वगैरे सगळे चोरू चोरी करू शकतील आणि विद्या जेवढी वाटू ना तेवढीच ती वाढत जाते विद्यारूपी धन हेच मनुष्याचं सर्वश्रेष्ठ धन आहे सो आय वुड रिस रिक्वेस्ट ऑल ऑफ यू टू कीप लर्निंग इवन ॲट दिस एज वी आर लर्निंग वेन एव आय गो एनिवेअर फॉर फंक्शन्स आय गेट अ स्मॉल टिप फॉर दॅम अँड आय पुट इट इन माय डायरी दिस इज वॉट इट शुड बी डन सो आय वुड से कीप लर्निंग आय एम ऑनर टू बी अमेंग सच अ ग्रे वास्ट गॅदरिंग ऑफ डी एस के स्कूल वे लर्निंग गिव्स क्रिएटिव्हिटी क्रिएटिव्हिटी लीड्स टू थिंकिंग थिंकिंग प्रोवाइड्स नॉलेज अँड दस नॉलेज मेक्स युअर चाइल्ड ग्रेट इन दिस स्कूल creativity is bubbling everywhere it is very clear as we have seen the innovative in invitation cards the backdrops the leds of course again we were talking this day is synonymous with excitement rehearsals enthusiasm uh, for children and of course anxiety expectation and nervousness for the teachers parents and grandparents how will my child do bagel ki nahi karel ki nahi karel ki nahi that is correct okay all the children have taken a lot of efforts to put in their best each child will be participating with matchless enthusiasm boundless energy a special mention for the efforts of the calm cool patient teachers and helpers who have handled and geared these tiny tots for this big day so patiently with perseverance determination and dedication tackling them at this tender age where 80% of the brain develops within the 0 to 6 age let's give them a big thumbs up and a great clap and finally one important thing for every parent or teacher should remember now especially with the nep do not prepare the road for your kids prepare the kids for the road thanks a lot for a patient hearing i again once again thank the management for inviting me and making my morning a very memorable one thank you thank you ma'am for your words of wisdom I now request the dignitaries on the stage to kindly take a seat in the audience and enjoy the program. I will not keep you waiting any longer and make way for the upcoming performances filled with color and exuberance. With this, I take your leave and request my colleagues Mrs. Pallavi Deshpande and Mrs. Poonam Kasture to take this event forward. Thank you so much. A very good morning to one and all present here. with the sun rising on for another beautiful day we are just getting started here i am mrs poonam kasture i am mrs pallavi deshpande together we are here to take you all on a beautiful journey in the dazzling little world of our little superstars so let's get started vakra tunda mahakaya surya koti samaprabha निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव 
Sarvakaryeshu Sarvada. As per our culture, we begin every auspicious occasion by worshipping Lord Ganesha. It is believed that he removes all the obstacles in the path of his followers and brings good luck. He blesses his followers with wisdom and knowledge. So parents, are you ready for the show? Yes! Sunai yes. Nidhiya? Okay, and keep your enthusiasm throughout the show. Please cheer them as and when required. Poonam teacher, आपने गणेश जी से कुछ मांगा है आज? Of course, Pallavi teacher. I have asked Ganesha to bless us and let this event go as we have planned for. And I know the best wishes of our parents and all the audience is with us. Do you agree, parents? Yes. Yes, our kids are going to rock, isn't it? Prince, please welcome our little devotees of senior cages who are all set to seek blessings of our favorite Bappa. विघ्न हरता सहस्र भक्त जन का तू एक करता धरता द्वेष मुक्त मन वो तू जिसमें वास करता इसीलिए तो सबसे पहले बोले बप्पा मोरे आरे ये विघ्न हरता ये बप्पा विघ्न हरता लगते राह है माथे पे जिसके भी निखरता कर्म की कसौटी पे है खरा उतरता इसीलिए तो सबसे पहले बोले बप्पा मोरे Start of the program and a wonderful, wonderful performance by this little devotees of Senior KG. They definitely boosted our energy and rocked the stage. Parents, please give them a big, big round of applause. Thank you so much. Sapne khab dreams. Isse chahi jis naam se bhi pukaro, ye utne hi meethe aur khubsurat lagte hain. We know that we all are dreamers and we have some or the other dream. Dreams are the second life we, where we wish to live in. 
दे गिव अस होप एंड करेज टू कीप गोइंग हर किसी के सपनों की दुनिया अलग होती है और अरमानों का आसमां भी बट द ड्रीम लैंड ऑफ आर लिटिल वंस इज द मोस्ट एक्साइटिंग एंड कलरफुल वन वे स्का इज द लिमिट एंड एवरीथिंग इज सिंपली मैजिकल सो पेरेंट्स फास्ट इन योर सीट बेल्ट एंड लेट्स गेट रेडी फॉर दिस वंडरफुल एरियल राइड इन टू द ड्रीम लैंड ऑफ आर लिटिल सुपर स्टार्स विद द थीम सपनों की उड़ान सो ऑडियंस हियर इज अ बोल फिल्ड विथ वंडरफुल ड्रीम्स ऑफ आर टाइनी टॉर्ड्स and we are going to unfold them one by one so are you all ready for the excitement yes. great now here comes our first dream and the dream is of our little champ miss vedanshi from nursery lily class she wants to be surrounded by chocolates toffees candies yum i am sure everyone's mouth might have started watering isn't it very good Poonam teacher, just imagine we are in a chocolate land. Pallavi teacher, I would have grabbed as many as I can. Because one se mera kya hoga? Sahi kaha? No one can eat just one. Ting ting ting. So let's visit this yummy chocolate land with the little stars of nursery Lily class. सावा सुंदर चॉकलेट सा बंगला असावा सुंदर चॉकलेट सा बंगला चंदेरी सोनेरी चमचमता चंगला चंदेरी सोनेरी चमचमता चंगला चॉकलेट चा बंगल्याला टॉफी चार चॉकलेट चा बंगल्याला टॉफी चार शेपटी Wow wow what a chocolatious performance by our little ones parents please give them a sweet round of applause pallavi teacher this chocolate world has indeed given a yummy treat to all of us now let's move ahead with our next dream and here we go oh this dream is of miss viranya from nursery rose who wants to fly high up in the sky explore the world in space touch the moon and play with the stars 
Hmm, so much fun, isn't it? Even I would love to do that. Parents, आपको नहीं लगता हमें भी इनके साथ आसमान की सैर करनी चाहिए सो प्लीज गेट रेडी टू गो ऑन एरियल राइड विथ आर लिटिल वंस एंड हैव अ ब्लास्ट it was let's give them a thundering round of applause so parents did you enjoy yes. i know you all are excited to see what is the next dream isn't it so now here it comes are jadu 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 is it going to be some magic show pallavi teacher no dear it's time to meet our guest jadu the alien which is the dream of our little friend master adwik from nursery aster class and i am sure that every tiny tot wants to have a friend like him just imagine jadu is here right in front of us wow what a sight to see so why waste time let's enter the spaceship of our tiny stars of nursery aster and fulfill their dream
magical performance by all these dazzling little dancers please give them a big round of applause and appreciate them please thank you so much now it's time to move on to our next dream and here we go this dream is of our little champ master indranil who has special love for colors amongst which red is his favorite one he wants to color the entire world and turn it red Red is the color of joy and happiness. He wants to see everyone happy and turn everything around him joyful. So let's welcome our tiny little stars of Junior KG Aster and help them to paint this world red. i 
what a colorful performance please give them a big round of applause now let's look at our next stream pallavi teacher can you hear some buzzing sound around is it giving a hint about the next dream yes our next uh, kid miss shreya from junior kg rose is a nature lover and wants to be surrounded by mother nature she wants to listen to the nature's music and mingle with her friends none other than bees butterflies and birds so let's get ready to enjoy the bliss of nature with our little stars of junior kg rose What a beautiful buzzing performance by our little dancers. I am sure listening to your sound that you enjoyed this performance thoroughly. Now it's time to move on to our next dream of the angel. And here we go. This dream is of Master Kumar from Junior KG Lily who wants to enjoy every moment of his life to the fullest and have fun. and create memories which he can cherish for future and forever he feels that life today has become so busy that we can enjoy with our near and dear ones only in our dreams so let's become a part of his dream and enjoy every moment to the fullest with the performance of junior kg lily kids
rocking performance this was please give them a huge round of applause now moving to the next stream in the list and this dream is of a tiny kid master kedar of nursery rose who is very fond of birds and he wants to see them in the natural surrounding and not in the cage in cities very rarely we can see them so he wants to go to his village where he can enjoy chirping of birds running behind the butterflies and spend happy moments in nature's lap so please welcome our little munchkins of nursery rose who are all set to take us with them in their dream village
beautifully done, little kids. What an amazing performance. Please give them a sparkling round of applause once again, parents. I hope even you had a very nice time enjoying the beauty of nature. Now it's time to move on to our next dream. And here we go. Oh, the next dream is of Master Shub from Senior KG Aster. And he is dreaming Zara Hatke. He wants to visit the Ram Mandir in Ayodhya and wants to see the beautiful idol of Ram Lalla. And he's fond of singing a very beautiful song. Ram Ji ki nikli sawari, Ram Ji ki lila hai nyari nyari. So let's celebrate this event with our tiny little devotees of Senior KG and let's worship Prabhu Shri Ram. Shri Ram Jai Ram, Shri Ram Jai Ram, Shri Ram Jai Ram. Wo aayenge, aayenge. Shri Ram Jai Ram, Shri Ram Jai Ram, Shri Ram Jai Ram. Ha wo aayenge, aayenge. Ha aayenge jab wo aayenge na ko sajaungi, deep jala ke khushiyan main manaungi. Shivai from Nursery Aster class wants to take, make everyone happy. Give everyone a world that is free from worries, tensions and sadness. Poonam teacher, look at our wonderful audience. They all are set to see her happy. So let's take her to a place that is full of joy and smiling faces in our next performance by Nursery Aster class. Hasi 
चरा के हम ताले लगा के चल तुम सो तराने चुप के चुप के जाए आधी आधी बाट ले आजा दिल की ये जमी थोड़ा सा तेरा सा होगा थोड़ा मेरा भी होगा अपना ये आशिया joyful performance parents please give them a loud round of applause for these kids who are planting innocence everywhere on the stage now it's time to move on to our next dream and here we go for this little dreamer this is a dream of our little master vibhash from nursery lily who wants to visit a circus and have fun with his friends he wants to be happy and enjoy every moment to the fullest punam teacher it's been so long even i have not visited any circus what about your parents have you visited a circus okay so are you all ready and excited to join the little ones so let's welcome our kids of nursery lily and enjoy their wonderful performance जैसे पानी बताशे हाथों से ना जान दे हाले हाले झरो के चल खोले खुशी के थोड़ी हवा तो आन दे दबे दबे पाओ जरा चले आओ ये पल मिलेंगे कहा ये जिंदगी है और क्या एक चुटकुला छोटे छोटे तमाशे जैसे पानी बताशे हाथों से ना जान दे हले हले झर के चल खोले खुशी के थोड़ी हवा तो आन दे
पूरी भाली प्यारी प्यारी आते सारी झोले में हा भर ले तमाशे जैसे पानी बताशे हाथों से ना जान दे हले हले झरो के चल खोले खुशी के थोड़ी हवा तो आन दे performance please appreciate our kids with for this rocking performance with a shower of claps now let's see which is the ne next dream in the queue and this dream is of master malhar he is highly inspired by chhatrapati shivaji maharaj who along with his army of most trusted warriors built the maratha empire our champ malhar has heard stories of the royal era and bravery of maratha warriors right from tanaji malusare to bajirao peshwa and he also wants to protect his people here he is all set with his army to celebrate the bravery of our warriors and their victory so please put your hands together for the little warriors of senior kg rozi to set the stage on the fire
राउंड ऑफ अप्लॉज फॉर दिस ब्रेव वॉरियर्स चीते की चाल बाज की नजर और बाजीराव की तलवार पर संदेह नहीं करते वेरी वेल डन लिटिल वॉरियर्स एंड नाउ इट इज टाइम टू मूव ऑन टू आर नेक्स्ट ड्रीम एंड द ड्रीम इन द लिस्ट इज ऑफ मिस शर्वी फ्रॉम जूनियर के जी लिली हु हैज अ लॉन्ग विश लिस्ट He wants to achieve all her dreams step by step and fulfill all her wishes. She keeps on saying that we have only one life and there are so many things to do. So let's make her dream come true and be a part of her dream and enjoy with Junior KG Lily class for the next performance. what an amazing performance i am sure that you all are also thinking about your wish list isn't it so now moving to our next dream and the dream is of master rudransh from senior kg lily who wants to become a soldier and protect our nation he is very much inspired by the bravery of our soldiers and wants to make everyone feel proud of him hats off to his patriotism सोल्जर बनने के लिए जिगरा चाहिए जिगरा सो लेट्स सी आर नेक्स्ट परफॉर्मेंस ऑफ द लिटिल सोल्जर्स फ्रॉम सीनियर के जी लिली क्लास रग रग में जोश की बूंदे बूंदों में जीत ही गूंजे इस गूंज से गिर जाएगा आसमान भी कदमों में जो 
जोश की बूंदे बूंदों में जीत ही गूंजे इस गूंज से गिर जाएगा आसमान भी कदमों में रोको ना सपनों के तूफानों को रोको ना जज्बों की उड़ानों को रोको ना आंखों के निशानों को आग जैसे बरसा दे ये इरादे जिगरा है जिगरा है जिगरा है जिगरा है and a power packed performance by these little soldiers of senior kg let's salute our nation by saying bharat mata ki jai this little ones have really enlightened our heart with the feeling of patriotism that is deeply rooted in our hearts now it's time to move on to our next dream and here we go oh this dream is of miss urvi from senior kg rose who wants to become an actress in bollywood she wants to grab all the fame and become a part of the bollywood family so why not let's become a part of her dream an entire premier party of bollywood with senior kg rose little superstars with the song om shanti om शाम बड़ी दीवानी धीरे धीरे बन जाए ना कोई कहानी देखो देखो है शाम बड़ी दीवानी धीरे धीरे बन जाए ना कोई कहानी दिल पर है दिल कश है दिलदार नजारे हैं आज जमी पर उतरे कितने सितारे हैं अगलो भूषण विदानम हम है दिल है मर जानम
What a wonderful journey to the Bollywood, isn't it? And it was a heart-seeing performance. So please give them a big round of applause. Now let's move on to our next dream. And this dream is of our, our little kid, Master Harsh, who wants to mingle with his friends and enjoy their company. He just wants to be the, be, be the way as he is and be happy in his life. Sure, Harsh, we wish you to be the happiest person. So what are we waiting for? Let's travel to his dreamland with his friends from Junior KG Rose class in our next performance. Wow, wow, 
what a super super performance by these little ones please give them a big round of applause now let's move on to our next stream okay this dream is of miss ashlesha from junior kg aster who wants to go for a world tour she wants to explore different countries abroad travel through plane through cruise and the list goes on so what the punam teacher even i want to go abroad at least once in my life sure dear you will but for now let's join our tiny little superstars and have become a part of their journey for their next performance and have a blast <laughs> What an adventurous performance it was! Parents, please give them a huge round of applause. Now here comes our last dream in the list, and this dream is of Miss Avni, who admires all the dancers who have achieved success in their career. She dreams to become become a great dancer and make everyone proud of her. So let's welcome our dancers of senior KG Aster class who are all set to rock the floor and fulfill the dream of their friend.
What a graceful performance by these little ones. Let's give them a rhythmic round of applause for this foot tapping dance. Now, I would like to call upon my colleague, Mrs. Nigda Bhatia, to take the charge. Thank you, Poonam teacher and Pallavi teacher. Good morning to one and all. Such magnificent performances deserve another round of applause. Don't you agree? <laughs> Thank you, parents. Thank you so much. As the event comes to an end, on behalf of all the students and the staff, I, Mrs. Nigda Bhatia, would like to am pleased and honored to express my vote of thanks for today's event. I would like to express my heartfelt gratitude to our chief guest, Mrs. Shubhada Pendarkar, ma'am, for gracing today's event. Your thoughts and presence today has indeed been a valuable treasure for us today. Thank you so much. I would like to thank all the dignitaries today who are present for the pre-primary event. And I would also like to thank our coordinator for always encouraging us to give our best. I would like to thank the support staff, the technical staff, all the kakas and the didis and everybody who has made this event a huge success today. Thank you so much. Before we conclude, I would like to call upon all the teachers on the stage, please. And I would like to invite Rama ma'am and Jayashri ma'am to kindly come and felicitate the teachers. I request all the parents to kindly stand up for the Vande Mataram song. Mom. 